is an outlet. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. For the last two, three months, we've been trying to put together a little owl vlog. Mm -hmm. We've used the trail camera, haven't we? We have. And, um, well, this is what we've got. Hope you enjoy. Now, the cut-off tree stump is where we've got the trail cam pointing to. And the tree in the background is where the little owls live. It was on the tree stump when I approached to put the trail cam on. It's extremely timid. I was over 50 metres away before it bounced off and flew away. So I don't think I'm going to stay long now that the trail cam's set up. And we'll just watch it from there and see what... Um, it gets up it gets up to and well try and learn from the footage and see if we can um, get any pictures okay bye the trail camera footage allowed us to see approximately what time the little owl visited the tree stump and how often per day the little owl visited we had it up for about a week and here are a couple of the clips of the interesting bits. Hello, got to be slightly quiet. You join me on a hold on, my phone's a bit wobbly. You join me on a um, little owl escapade. The one that I've been filming with my trail cam is so timid, so timid. We've been finding it really, really hard to get any photos, to interact with it, to get anywhere near it, apart from the obviously the trail cam being left there for a week. We've, we've had no luck. So I was speaking to a, a very good wildlife photographer friend of mine who put us on to another location, which was um, a bit further away, but pretty near. And I'm here now, and I have found a much more obliging little owl. This is a scouting little session. Um, I will take, bring Rich here, and um, we'll, um, see if we can get some photos. At the moment I'm just scouting to find the area. I found the area and the little owl's there straight away. So I'm just having a little film, filming him and then I'll report back to my boss to see if um, it's a go-ahead. So hopefully if it's a go-ahead you will have seen this vlog and um, We'd have got the owls. I have located the little owl and he or she is currently asleep. arrived at the second location of the little owls I brought Richard and as we were pulling up at one of the barns around the other side we saw them go in so we got to stay put in the car and wait hopefully hopefully they'll come out because Richard hasn't seen these ones here yet so fingers crossed Richard is there with his bean bag and camera set up. <clears throat> I'm in the front with my bean bag and camera set up. And we're just waiting now, aren't we? Mm -hmm. Do you like the second location? I do. Compare it to the first one to be honest. Well, no. If we got if I actually got a picture of the first 
and it would be better, I think. You have got pictures. I have. Just distant. But not one that I'm happy with. But they're, they're okay. But this little owl or owl seem, well, I'd say more reliable, but I don't know really, because they're the ones seems to be there most times with me, but... So yeah. just, they're just crafty? They are. In general, aren't they? Mm-hmm. But we better be quiet, so we'll, we'll be back. Well, we just saw an owl and an owlet, um, but it was difficult getting in the correct position. Keep shifting the car about. Um, but we managed to get some stressful. footage that oh, was stressful. stressful. Um, they're still here but distant now so we're just sitting waiting and watching but we have got some footage and some pictures so in respect of that it's a success. little bit annoyed because the pictures I took when it was sitting in the roof space um, were okay and then I was about to flick to video well I did actually just flick to video to get some some nice video of it and it flew off so <laughs> I missed the opportunity there um, it may come back uh, it may not but, but We've had, would you say we've had fun, Gemma? Oh, I've loved it. Absolutely loved it. Uh, <laughs> I wedged the tripod up against the window and gouged my car. Scratched her car. <laughs> but there were some expletives flying about. <laughs> we had a tiny bit of a bicker. Yeah, but that's normal. <laughs> oh, Don't no, it's not. Don't worry about that. Never normal. But um, on the bright side, it's a lovely evening, and we're having an Indian later, so yeah. <laughs> things can't be that bad. Well, what did you think? That was good, wasn't it? Yeah, what did you think of the location? Very good, very good. Yeah? Very um, easy to get to and um, to park the car. It was okay, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Thank you, friend, for telling us. Yep. Um, we got to see Owlet. Yes. The adult owl. Yes. Got um, some video, got some pictures. <laughs> it was tricky to stay in the car. I don't know how we're going to go if we come back i don't know how we're gonna work around this no but, we, but it's just a case of shifting the car about in it because mm -hmm. we might be, nice be able to get out, out of the car. well we might be able to get out of the car the next we'll time see. yep um but i hope you've enjoyed it and enjoyed the footage and the photos and we'll see you again we will bye bye good afternoon even <laughs> is it yes yeah, good afternoon lunch time yeah do you want to tell people where we are? Not where we are, no. Yep, there it is. Next to that fucking chimney. <laughs> They've got to stop rocking the car, otherwise I can't film it. Yeah, but Darren, I can film it if I can move the car. Well, what's wrong with me filming it? Keep on swearing! Oh. Oh.
that's got a mind of its own. There's just no point taking him anywhere. <laughs>